Every day, at least once a day, we should spread thoughts of goodwill to remind ourselves of why we're here, why we're practicing. We want a happiness that lasts, and a happiness that doesn't harm anybody else, both for their sake and for our sake. In other words, if our happiness harms them, it's going to be bad karma. And at the same time, they're not going to stand for it. They're going to try to destroy it. So happiness, to be true, has to take into consideration the happiness of others. And you also want to make sure that when you're interacting with others that you're coming from goodwill. Otherwise it's very easy to think you can get away with something unskillful. Which means you can't trust yourself to always create good karma. So we develop thoughts of goodwill not because other people deserve our goodwill, but because we need it as our own protection. So it's good to remind ourselves of that every day. As the Buddha said, when you harm yourself, it's through breaking the precepts, doing unskillful things. To harm other people really is to get them to do unskillful things. It's interesting to think about that, because we basically come down to the fact that each of us experiences well-being or misery based on our own actions, zero respecting the fact that other people are agents just like you, making choices that work for good or for evil. And you want to think about the long term. So you don't want to break any precepts. You don't want to get anybody else to break any precepts. You don't want to act in a harm, any kind of harmful way. You don't want others to act in harmful, harmful ways. For your sake and for their sake. And then allow that thought to spread out to infinity. It may seem like it's getting a little bit diluted when it goes out to infinity, because there are very few people out at the edge of infinity that you are going to be dealing with. But try to remind yourself you want to extend it to everybody. So as you go through the day and you encounter people who are really disagreeable, okay, you still have goodwill for them. They're part of this infinite extension that you made for your goodwill. And again, remember that whether you know them or not, whether you like them or not, the things you do to them are going to be your own karma. So be very careful in every case. And that way our goodwill spreads around and it becomes a motivation for skillful action. It's not just a nice sentiment. But it becomes part of the mind's calculations for when it wants to do something, whether it's worth doing or not. And that way it can make a real difference.